what do you want to accomplish? What do you want to achieve this year? Is there something you've always wanted, always dreamed of, but instead you convinced yourself you're not worthy? You've said to yourself, I'm not good enough. I don't deserve to be happy. I'll never be healthier. Well, that's not right. That's not true. This isn't as good as it gets. It can and will get better, but you have to take action. Forget the limiting beliefs of the past. 2019 is your year. This is the year you change the past. This is the year the impossible becomes possible. Hello there, this is Dominic Damaski, Motivation Champs, and today I wanted to talk to you about resolutions. It's that time of year, and so many people are down on resolutions. They're going to tell you the statistics, and they're going to say only 10% of the people that set a resolution accomplish that goal. Well, forget all that. Today, I am going to help you achieve that goal. We all have things that we're hoping to accomplish. There are things that you want to achieve. There are things that I want to be better at. And this year, we're going to set a resolution. We're going to make it a goal. We're going to write it down, and we are going to accomplish that goal. No longer are we going to let anybody else bring us down. We are going to accomplish that goal. I don't care how big that resolution is. I want you to have a big one. But I also want you to get there. So we're going to we're going to say it out loud and we're going to write it down and we're going to follow through. That's how we're going to get there. However big it is, we are going to take action and we're going to have a plan. Without a plan, we're in big trouble. Without taking action, you are screwed. Whatever it is that you want to accomplish in 2019, become that thing. Be that thing. If you want to lose weight, if you want to be a baker, Start to do that thing. Start to Google it. Start to study it. Become that. Live that. If you want financial freedom, live that. Don't tell me you want financial freedom and then you're buying $5 Starbucks every day. Become the thing you want. Sacrifice the things you don't want to become who you want. got some ideas in their heads this year I'm gonna have a healthier relationship I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of some debt I'm gonna get in better shape I'm gonna start running I'm gonna stand up straight a few years ago I realized that I had bad posture and my back was hurting a lot so little by little I started putting my shoulders back and trying to stand up straighter I set that as a resolution like two years ago and for a year my my kids will say Dom that's puffing up again and I still do it I'll sit somewhere I'll sit out on the end of the chair and I'll just put my shoulders back and now two years later I have less back problems and you might say oh that's a silly resolution I'll stand up straight but that was something I set out to do and two years later I followed through on it I wrote it down I had a plan of attack strengthened my shoulders strengthened my back strengthened my core and I'm getting there What's your goal? Think about it and write it down. It's got to be written down because if it's not written down, you're going to forget about it. See, I got boards over there. They have goals on them. I can look at them over and over and see, I got to finish that. I got to finish that. I come down. It's a constant reminder. I have little books where I have goals written down. Every time I open those up, I see them. See them right there. Write them down. Write them everywhere. Don't be afraid. Tell people, this year, this year I'm going to do this. This year I'm going to do that. This year I'm going to live a healthier lifestyle. Here's the ways I'm going to do it. I'm going to eat less fried chicken. I'm going to eat less pizza. And I'm going to try to cut down on my beer. That's my, that's resolution, healthier lifestyle, how I'm going to get there. Less beer, less fried chicken, less pizza, exercise. There are going to be days you question yourself. There's going to be days where you question why you set this goal, why you had this resolution. There's going to be failures. There's going to be setback. But you got this. You can handle it. You're prepared. You 
have a plan of attack. You wrote down your goals. Look back at them. Remember how you felt before, before you set out, before you set out on this mission, on this journey. Remember how you felt. Remember why you chose to do it. I study inspiration and motivation. I get it. I know that resolutions have been around thousands of years, but yet today only 40% of the population even sets a resolution. I know that only 3% have written goals. Only 1% write them down more than one time. So we are going to set a plan of attack to accomplish our goals. We're going to tell people our goals and then we're going to set a plan in place so you and me can achieve those goals, whatever they may be. This is Dominic Damaski, Motivation Champs, and this is the year we beat the odds. 2019 is your year. We got the plan of attack. We're going to make it happen. I believe in you. I hope you enjoyed the message. If you like it, please share it. 2019, your year.